What's up, YouTube? It's Maverick, and I'm back with another episode of PGA Tour with Moose McConnell. Last episode was our very first PGA Tour event. We're here with our second event. This is the Shriners Hospitals for Children Open at the TPC Summerlin. So this is a big course. First place gets 500 points towards the FedEx Cup points. 18 holes, 144 people in the event. We're going to jump right on in like we have been doing. And uh, no changes at this time need to be made. I probably could upgrade some of my clubs. And in fact, uh, I will do that before the next episode. At least if I remember to do it before the next episode. We've been playing pretty good golf the last couple of rounds. We start off slow both rounds and then we come out strong in the back nine. Uh, right around the 13th hole is where we start just draining and getting birdies, you know. So... We have a new rival, uh, I believe it's Cameron Champ, so we'll be compared to him all the time. So looking forward to this round, TBC Summerlin. Welcome to our PGA Tour coverage here on 2K Sports. Today's coverage of the Shriners Hospitals for Children Open is about to start. Luke will be alongside Rich Beam here in Las Vegas, it's known as Thin City. But we're at TPC Summerlin for the Golden. All right, I was wondering where Summerlin was. It's in uh, Las Vegas. Very nice course. So players going into this week know full well that they have to have the putter going. They need to hit a lot of greens, but they also it's very difficult. Sure that they're making five, six, seven birdies a day out there. What a great first shot! Birdies and only making pars, then the entire field is going to pass them by. It's a great opportunity because historically the wind no wind wow no winds we don't have to account for that still having to make birdies knowing you need to make birdies isn't always the easiest thing We're in Vegas. hit it too hard the famous strip from the golf course to the players need to roll the dice have a little gamble out on that course I think you have not bad though on the PGA Tour. I could have been a little softer it's required, isn't it? You're rude not to. long birdie putt to today that's for sure Interesting break on this. Okay, I had the right idea. We're going to move it a little bit more. <gasps> what are you doing? What are you doing? It's my finger slipped off of the joystick. Oh my gosh. Okay, not a good start. Ooh, nice line. <sighs> oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. All right, so we're starting yeah, off. Will be for bogey. Starting off bad. Finger slipped off the joystick there on that par putt, or the birdie putt. I mean, look how they played the hole. It was disastrous. Lucky to walk away with a bogey. The second at TPC Summerlin is a par four, measuring 469 yards from the back tee. It plays slightly downhill, so a strong drive here will set up even just a short iron approach. However, there's a huge waste area to the right, so accuracy off the tee is required. The smart option here is to lay back with the three metal and give yourself a I mean, shot in. And also take one club less into this green as it will release down the slope. Oh, I, oh, I should have listened to that guy before I... Yeah, yeah, I should have won a club down. Okay. Well, this Note to self. Downtown, but you're closer. John, what's he got in front of him? This is going to be a straight putt. Four feet to the cup, guys. A long straight putt. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. So I'm just going to move it over just a hair. There. Hit it too hard. Pushed it to the right. That might blast oh, past oh. Oh, my gosh. Long putt, though. You go here to the hole. That's a good putt for par. You'll take it. Well, we, we managed to get a par, so um, we've had some birdie opportunities already after two holes. So I don't, I'm not stressing. We're going to continue to do okay. We just got to sink those birdie putts. measuring 492 yards. There's a huge ravine that works right up through the middle of this. It requires a very strong drive up the right half. Wow, push that way more than I expected. Tuck over and get up and down for your par that way. Tough second shot. Look at this. 
We gotta hit an accurate shot here. Hit it fast. Hit it a little powerful. This is all over it like a tropical disease. Gonna leave a long putt, but I think we're okay. But you never know. A little more break than I anticipated. Wow, what an ugly swing that was. If my swing swing straight, that might have been in. This one is for his par. You know? Okay, let's head to the next. Another par four coming up. Johnny Mac, what's the news? Down here on the fourth hole, this is Cameron Champ. And this putt is for birdie. Oh, this is that guy. Oh no, 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 no. I didn't mean to skip it. I need to watch him. He's probably gonna dominate me this round. <clears throat> I'm tied for 54th. I gotta get a birdie. Straight away, par four, measuring 450 yards from the back tees. The fairway bunkers down the Oh, what an ugly swing. That's gonna hit the only sandbox. Oh, okay. Oh, this is not a good outcome. Buried in the deep stuff. Gotta hit it hard. Looks to be going with the five iron. It's okay. That's gonna all right. That actually I think I'd rather have it roll off like that. Yeah, he's not hit the mark on that approach. Oh a man, shot. okay. Has hit a lot of greens today, just not on this occasion. It fast, way too fast. Okay, I'm having I'm 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 really having some hard times here. Oh wow, what a misread that was. Okay. Definitely need to regroup. Hit it too hard. It's tracking. Okay. My mind's not right, guys. Not sure if they understood the lie of the land there, Rich. Eleven feet to the cup. Oh, it was nice to see that go in because it has been pretty darn. All right, two bogeys. We got a lot of a lot of work to do. We're um not looking good at all. Depending on where they put the tees on this hole ensures the type of club you need to get at it. If you're going at it, make sure you avoid that bunker that's short and right. Hit it fast. Got to get that tempo in check. But I'm glad I went down a club. Did a decent job lining up that shot. I think we need to go a little more. There. Good straight putt. That could be. Oh, I lipped it. Oh, I needed that so bad. Oh my god. You can go and put a par on the card. Yeah, we got a par. Par threes are, in my opinion, the hardest holes. Sitting at a couple over for the day. The sixth at TPC. All right. Is a staking Blowing right through, through these holes. Thirty yards. There's a big waste area up to the left-hand side that needs to be avoided. If you can position your drive on the right half of this fairway, hit it fast again. The hill to a green that is not protected. But manage to keep it in the fairway. And this shot here coming up from around 130 yards. Hmm. Wow, why am I why am I hitting it so dang fast? I just cannot get that thing down, can I? With that approach, not a good leave. Our coverage continues here at the twelfth. And 
110 yards or so to the pin. This one looks like it'll safely make the green. Sitting at two over par. Oh. You better believe it is great stuff to watch. My my swing is all over the place. It, it's. Our leader is a couple of shots Let's get it straightened out. Let's get the tempo right. It's all in the head. It's all in the head. The TPC is a short par four we got a lot of catching up to do. We're two over. Really, you just want to avoid the trees on the left hand side because that will prevent you getting at the green, which is well guarded by bunkers and trees. Lay up, short right. Really? Nice little wedge in here. Really? Try and make a birdie. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. There it is, baby. There it is. And sets up another birdie chance. There it is. This one started out on a good line. There it is, baby. Yes. Yeah, nice mid range birdie putt. That let's get let's birdie one of these other two holes in the front nine. We got two holes left on the front nine. Let's birdie one of them. Get back to even starting the back nine. That's that's our goal. The eighth at TPC Summerlin is a big par three playing 239 from the tips. A well struck shot will avoid the gully here, but anything to the left half can roll off the green. The bunker short right. Not bad. I'll take that. I'll take that for a par three with a three wood. Come on, look after us. Little bounce to the right. Probably could have aimed right at it at the pin though. Head over to the nine. Sitting at two under par. Cameron Champ, my rival. Two under par, and he just sunk wow, that chip sad. shot. All over the parking lot, but a chip in for par saves the day. Let's get back to it. Shall so we? he's three strokes it's ahead of me. Two on the scorecard. Oh, that was that for yeah. That was for birdie. I didn't leave myself a, a good birdie putt though. That's okay. The ninth at TPC Sumlin was a par five measuring over five. All right, we got this is a, a par five, so we got an opportunity. To just avoid that bunker off the left of the tee, then if safely in the fairway, a little fast, green. A strong shot will play to the left half of this green and feed down to any hole location. A birdie chance, no doubt. John, do you have any info down there? Down here on the 15th, fellas. This is Ian. His next shot. Pewter, 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 Pewter. I don't know. Whoa! Oh, that's great. Oh, Whoa! Holes out for a birdie. Ooh, tasty little pitch shot. Gets wow, and he had a double bogey. Pumps all One of his holes, huh? Typically played in the fall portion of the season, but it really does have a great field these days. The Shriners Hospital for Children's Open, stays in Las Vegas. There it is. A great atmosphere around in the city. Can you get up on that? Yeah, baby. Look at that roll. That's what I'm talking about. And the players love it too, but they also love what the Shriners Hospital for Children is all about. They give so much money back to the charities involved. It's wonderful. They bring a lot of the kids out, and the players understand it. For Eagle. So oh, whoa, the bigger, players, more break than I just read that one. It has to go back to the charity component of it. That's why they come. The golf course is fun. You can freewheel it out here. It is at the beginning of the year. They want to come out and they want to make some birdies. They want to test out new equipment. They want to test out new swing theories. They want to come out and work on their game a little bit in a competitive environment. And there's no better environment than this because they can go out and see where they're at. Because okay. there's usually no wind, warm conditions, and you can get a good judge of exactly where We got a birdie. So we had an opportunity for an eagle. That would have been really nice to have the eagle right there. 
Almost. Almost got an eagle. Uh, not quite. But we start, like like I said, we got to start the back nine at even. And it never hurts to make a fast start to the new season. Of course, this is part of that wraparound schedule. And if you're catching a few shows as well or hitting into the casinos, well, you get a complete week, don't you? Wow, I mean, there's... Stayed on the fairway. A bit of fun in Las Vegas, is there? As long as it stays in Las Vegas. A little fast. It's going to push us to the left more than I would like. That's well played. Pin high. He's already had a few birdies today. This for another. And Earlier today on hole 16. Ago, this is Ian again? Shot here. Are you telling me he made another one? Oh, that guy. This guy's moment. ridiculous. Down as a highlight today. Or is that the same one? Let's return to live play now. Trying to get to one under here with this putt. Almost got the read right. If I miss this, though, I have an issue. This one's looking good. There it is. The putt drops, and that's back to back. Birds. All right, we are. We're feeling it now. We're feeling it now. We had a couple of holes at the beginning. It was a bit of a struggle, but Moses, we're top 25. Placement off the tee is required at the TPC Summerlin 11th hole, par four, measuring 448 yards. The big bunker down the right side is to be avoided at all costs. Perfect, baby. Tree there, which might affect any line of sight approach this green. This looks to be a fairway seeker to me. This shot. Glad we don't have to worry about the wind. That's that's nice. About getting the aim and the stroke right on this course, and you're. Ooh, okay. I maybe could have went down a down a uh, a club. This is a hard read. I, I don't know. Yeah. We were close. Oh, I like the look of this. Ooh. Oh, see that line was looking good, wasn't it? That was a good line. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. I'm okay. And we're right there where we need to be. Down the standings after that hole. We're still in the top 25, but I have a feeling if we don't get another birdie, we're gonna be we're gonna be cooked out of that top 25. Didn't hit it hard enough. Okay though. Only 96 power swing, but we still hit it 305 yards. Okay. From about 130 yards here. With the nine That's nine beautiful, nine. baby. As long as it. Wow. Okay. Maybe I should have put a little backspin on it. I don't know. Trying to get to two under with this part. A long, dangerous birdie putt. Hit it too hard, maybe. Yeah. And pushed it to the right. Good chance this one. Right on six feet. Didn't hit it hard enough. Hold this one. Oh gosh. And in it goes for the par. I keep missing some golden birdie putt opportunities. Position on the leaderboard after that effort. The 13th at TPC Summerlin is a monster par five, measuring over 600 yards from the back tees. 600 yards? With the tail breeze, can cover that bunker on the left-hand side. But if you want to lay up, make Ugly. sure you're giving yourself the right number. Ugly, but it's going to be in the fairway. And plenty of ways to three-putt it. Be careful on approach. 
Moments ago, a beautiful shot happened on the course. Let's take a look at it. The impressive oh, you can't even see the guy. An amazing shot. They've hold it. Can't even see the guy. Cameron Champion, he's four under. Holy moly. He's going to beat me today. To the course with the live action. Cameron Champ is one of those players that exploded. I think we're going to go. We're going to aim over here because of that bunker. But now he's facing that sort of second year syndrome, isn't he? He is. What did you do? I think his power can get him through the tough times. I think that if he figures out a way to learn how to play the golf course on the PJ Tour effectively, even his bad weeks will start making cuts and being in contention a little more often. As with most young players, they just need time to develop. Well, um, I kind of saved myself a little bit there, but the, oh my gosh, this, the, I mean, this putt. <sighs> starts a break and then just straightens out. Can't even, um, can't even get a read on it. We need to go there, maybe. Didn't hit it hard enough. I don't know why. Ooh. Oh, wait, well, that worked out. And that should secure the par. Well done. Yeah, we got a par. Let's take a look at the leaderboard as it stands. Um, we probably are knocked out of the top 25 at this. No, we're still there. Barely. Cameron Champ, 500, tied for second place. The TPC Sumlin is a straightaway par three, playing 168 yards. The green slopes right to left, so make sure you've got the right length of club so you're not left with a long part. And choosing the eight iron. What am I doing? Uh, I'm not sure that's, that's two that's holes in a row that I um Let's have a look at Patrick Cantley. John Very slow. I don't know. Well guys, this is looking like about twenty oh, no, guys. seven feet. This would be a great up and down from this spot. Didn't hit it hard enough. What? Come on. We are with the third shot. Well, I've really choked, huh? Hit that one fast. I'm scared to hit it freaking slow. Well, this will be a bonus. Right on 17 from here. Get in the hole. Okay. Oh. Oh dear. This next putt now for double bogey. Double bogey, huh? And there it is. Wow. Five, five strokes on a par three. Backing up slowly but surely on that leaderboard, Luke. That's not good. Now we're back to one over. Great short par four. In fact, a lot will try and drive it in the tournament. If you want to lay it back. You've got around about 115 yards uphill to a green where you can't see those back hole locations. However, a good aggressive... That might be in the area. sand on the left. Avoid the pot bunkers around the green. Yep. Or the big waste area to the left. A chance to make a birdie here or even an eagle. Here's a chance to get up and down from the green side bunker. Eh. Uh. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. That's makeable. Nope. Oh, what a Just shot. missed it. Been a nice one to and the putt drops. Now one of course, it's harder than you think it is. Definitely harder than you think. Now, I've, I've had some bad shots, though. I, I really have. TPC Sumlin is another one of those great scoring holes en route to the finish. 
The par five playing 560 yards. The well-struck drive up the right half here gives you a chance to get at this green in two. If you are going for the green, make sure you've got enough club. Oh, my gosh. In front of it will ruin any score. Be careful going through the green here as well. Screw it. Let's go for it. It's not that easy. Opting for the three wood. Oh, Cleared it. Left all the way off the club. Long put. And now intrepid on course. I just wanted to make sure I got over. Well, I'm down here on the 17th hole, and this is a look at Gary Woodland. This would be a great up and down. Whew. Oh, how good was that? Not a good lie. Fortunate to hit the pin and go in. Might be nice to make this one. This one's for Eagle. <sighs> okay. Um. I don't even know, man. I mean, we're talking almost a hundred feet. There's not a chance. Okay, we're go we're looking at one, two, three and a half. Not enough. Still not enough, huh? Just hammer that through the line. What an opportunity to make a birdie. Oh my gosh, I almost missed that. And that but I got a birdie. He's back to even par now. Got back to even. Up the lead Top 50. Never a bad Two holes left. I mean, it, it, the <laughs> PC Summerlin is a downhill par 3 playing 196 yards. Jonathan Bird once famously holed out in the playoff here to snatch the title. The green shapes right to left towards the hazard. So make sure if you're going to go. Not for good. It, Not happy. good. Okay. All right. It ended up a little bit better than I expected. And this one for back to back birdies. We're going to go half a square over. Wow. We didn't have to uh, go that far. Okay. Um, go back. Get in the hole, baby. Oh, make this one. It's for par. And down it goes. Well, uh, if we finish even, uh, I mean, as bad as we played, finishing even won't be too bad. A few shots under par. You know, trying to break into the top ten. Wow, he hit that from like. Oh. Oh my god. What? Nasty lie out of the rough, but look at awesome. this in the hole. Can you believe it? Our current leader is enjoying a one shot lead. So after that hole, this is what All the right, so looks like. One more hole. The 18th at TPC Sutherland is a 444 yard par four with a big body of water just beyond the gully, which you've got to drive. Make sure you avoid those bunkers on the right side to give you a good iron into this green. Oh, look at that water there on the left. That one should find the fairway. Going with the eight iron here. Good choice. Good choice, Moose. A lot easier when you can hit a shot like that. Of all the shots that I like the most, that one ranks right up there. This one's for birdie. And that oh my god. Almost missed that. Alright, 100. <laughs> not the best round of golf that we've played, but not the worst either, you know? Always something to learn in this game, and hopefully this player has learned a lot. Little stressful. That was a very stressful round of golf. I will have to admit. We made top 25, though. 
got that going for us. Got a new glove. Might have to throw that on. Uh, earn some uh, currency there. And uh, Cal, uh, I mean, he beat us. I won the back nine. He won the front. Uh, he beat us by one one hole. Huh, one stroke. Not one hole, one stroke. All right, so we just contract expire. You get two, you get two, what? Wow, okay. So the contract, you only get two. Rounds of golf. Didn't know that. Did not know that. Now that you've completed your first contract, you're free to browse and choose your next sponsor contract. You can access the sponsor club or sponsor hub through the sponsor button on the play tab. Each brand will offer up to three difficulties of sponsor contracts to challenge your skills on the golf course. We'll probably start with easy. Uh, let's go ahead and look at that right now. Um, what do y'all think? I'm thinking uh, maybe some tailor maids. Good tailor made. Let's see what they got. Three events. Contract completion for. Let's start with easy. Can I do multiple? Oh, maybe not. Let, let me look. Let me pick a different one, like Under Armour. I guess you only get one at a time. That's fine. All right, guys, that's it for this episode of PGA Tour with Moose McConnell. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, and that little bell icon so you can be notified the next time I post another video. And, of course, if you want to come chat with me live, I'm currently streaming on Twitch Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Until next time, y'all have a good one.